Hey, I'm on my way to go vote, and let's see, I'm just a little nervous because uh, you don't know what to expect. Hopefully, there's no line. It's 8.50, and it actually started about 7 o'clock. I wanted to be asleep, but I also wanted to have my eight hours of sleep, so hopefully there's no line. I officially have voted for President Clinton. See, my little sticker right here. Can't go wrong for that. And let me tell you, because a lot of people have no clue that when you go in there, you want to have your pamphlets, you know, because you really don't know, especially if you haven't read any of this stuff that comes in the mail. It's good to have all this information. That way you have a clue of who you're voting for. Because everybody can't remember. Who the heck to remember? HH and RR and JJ. And <laughs> I was like, what the hell? And then that marijuana law. Lord have mercy. I am not for that. Only for the simple fact of I don't smoke. I can't stand that smoke. And it just seems like everybody in the world want to smoke. It's okay for them to do it. I mean, if you want to do it in your own house, you know, and you're at the park or somewhere, go ahead and do it, but don't do it at the bus stop. And then you want to get on the bus, and then you got to smell up the whole damn bus, especially on the day when I tend to run out of lights off. So once again, y'all, go out and vote. If you're 18, go out and vote. You don't have to do like everybody. I mean, we want you to vote, we want you to vote for Democratic, but at the same time, we want you to vote for the other things. So if you don't vote for a president, at least we know that, you know, you did put in your two cents, as they call it. All right, now, y'all have a good day. Like my page, leave a comment if you have any questions, subscribe to my channel, and make sure that you, um, Look at that book that you got in your house because it actually tells you where you need to go and vote. You can't just go anywhere because I remember one year we was in Westchester. Man, I got there like two hours in advance. Got there just in time. Had to stand in line for two hours. And then I was lucky and was able to still go to work that same day. You hear different places. People are out there going weeks in advance putting their mail, mailing vote in the mailbox. Don't know how long that's gonna take, and I don't know if you guys are aware, but somebody last week delivered like 80 ballots to one person. I guess either they gave up or they just didn't want everybody to go out and vote. I don't know. We're gonna pray for those people though. All right now, have a good day. This is my official ballot receipt. Deuces.